High in Chile's Atacama Desert, one of the world's biggest astronomical projects is getting underway. Around a third of the large dish antennas that gather information about our cosmos by observing microscopic wavelengths are now operating, with the rest due to come online next year. The telescope is called ALMA, or Atacama Large Millimeter Submillimeter Array, and is a joint 2 billion euro project between partners in North America, Europe and East Asia. Astronomer Anna Hughes uses the facility to look at molecular clouds. I look at molecular clouds in nearby galaxies. Uh, molecular clouds are where stars form. Um, the clouds are made up of very cold gas. Uh, and studying the physical conditions in these clouds helps us to understand the star formation process. The telescope, the biggest in the world, has been designed to see the coldest matter in space, including cool galaxies at the farthest reaches of the universe and dense clouds of freezing gas which form stars. Well, we know of some galaxies that exist in the faraway universe that are only seen in certain wavelengths. So, for example, I, uh, we know about radio galaxies that are not uh, observed in any other wavelength. Scientists are hoping to be able to see the process by which galaxies and solar systems are formed and about how our own planet came to exist. <laughs>